Hey guys, uh, welcome to your June 2023 prediction reading for Pisces. Uh, this is going to be for June. Um, you can apply this to any of your placements because this reading can be about anything, nothing specific. We're just going to see what the cards have to say. So we're going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys. And then we'll finish off the read to see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Uh, keep in mind that these are general messages. Uh, take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. Uh, keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Pisces people, not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular. If you're looking for a reading tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies, I suggest you to uh, book a personal reading with me. The link for that is in the description box below. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live. Uh, also, I've been posting readings on my TikTok page and my Instagram page. So if you guys are not following me on those platforms, you can feel free to follow me. Uh, the links are in the description box below, okay? So Pisces. Tell me about Pisces here. What's going on with Pisces for June 2023? What is going on with Pisces for June 2023? June 2023 for Pisces here. What's going on with Pisces for June 2023? We have the Two of Swords here. With the Page of Wands in the reverse. Okay. I don't know. I feel like it's almost like someone here is angry about a decision that they made. It could have been like a very a premature decision here. Uh, it, it could be like a decision that was made where someone here didn't really think about it. Someone here acted on impulse here. But I feel like it's a, it's a decision that someone here feels like they want to take back, but then they can't take back because I feel like someone here made the decision already. Okay. Uh, Page of Wands in the reverse. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Energy with the Four of Swords. And the Fool. Aries energy, Aquarius energy here. Seven of Swords. And the Hierophant here. I also feel like someone here is questioning a lot of things right now. Questioning about their faith. Questioning about the higher power here. <sighs> I feel like it's almost like someone here is not trusting it or someone here needs a break from it. Yeah, someone here needs a break from it. Why, why is this Hierophant here? It could be a situation that someone here is about to break a promise here. Maybe that's, that's a decision that someone here feels like they made a wrong decision. It's like maybe someone here promised some, someone something here, but someone here is about to break it. The Hierophant here and the Emperor Aries energy. Seven of Swords here, and the Four of Pentacles. Hmm. Seems like there's a situation that you're in right now that you're dealing with where someone here is withholding the truth here from you, Pisces. Like someone here is not telling you the truth. Whatever this lie that this person's holding on to, I do feel like it's going to hurt you. Yeah, the devil here, Capricorn energy. It seems like someone here is about to reveal themselves or who they are as a person here. Yeah, and I feel like you're going to dip out because of that, uh, 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 Pisces. Tell me about the Page of Wands in the reverse. Why is the Page of Wands in the reverse here? I'm with the King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius energy. Tell me about the Two of Swords. In the moon. Hmm. Uh, also, Pisces, if you've been in this self sabotaging energy, that's changing here. It's like, it's almost like someone here is rising from the darkness here. If you've done some sort of, if you've gone through some sort of dark night of the soul here, you're coming out of that. Uh, if there has been addi addi addiction issues or behavioral issues, you're coming out of that here. There, there could be a situation that someone's health is not really good here, too. Uh, it doesn't have to be you, but it could be someone that you know that's in or around your life. Uh, someone here has like a, a chronic illness here that they're dealing with. 
And I feel like it's a situation where someone here wants to enjoy their life more here too. I mean, it could be a father figure. Yeah, a mother figure here. What else do we have here for Pisces? What else does Pisces need to look out for, work on here? Six of Cups and the Five of Cups. There's some sort of regret regarding the past here. Queen of Swords and the Two of Cups. The Chariot and the Magician here. So it could be a situation that someone here could be coming in to reconcile here with you. Whoever this is, this is an individual that regrets maybe hurting you. Yeah. It, it, maybe, it, maybe it's this person that realized that they made a bad decision here. Yeah. Uh, someone here broke a promise. But you know what, Pisces, you're done with this person because like I said, I feel like you're coming you're you're raising you're raising from the darkness here. You know, you're leaving this behind. Uh you, you know, you're 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 in this energy of perhaps dropping this. Yeah, you're, or dipping out. Um the chariot, Cancer energy and the magician Gemini Virgo. Seems like you're taking control of your life here because it could be a situation that you've lost control here by dealing with a toxic individual here, okay? It could, it could have been the situation that, it could have been the karmic situation that you were in here. Uh, this situation that you're in, it could be a same-sex a couple here. It doesn't have to be, but you can apply this to your own unique situation. But like I said, I feel like you're rising from the, the, rising from the darkness here, Pisces, okay? Six of Cups. Perhaps part of the darkness that you experience is with this individual that's trying to come back around. Six of Cups and the Ten of Wands, Five of Cups and the Queen of Cups here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. I mean, you could be doing a lot of releasing here too. Releasing uh, of the past here, uh, releasing of self-fulfilling prophecies here of yourself. Um, just a lot of releasing here because it's almost like, uh, you know, perhaps you let yourself down by doing that. Um, Queen of Swords, you know, the Eight of Wands here, Two of Cups. You're receiving communication from somebody here, definitely. Whoever this is, this is an individual that wants to work out this relationship. Yeah, I, I, I just get the sense that you're totally done with this here, uh, uh, Pisces. I do feel like you're that masculine here. Yeah, perhaps you're reconnecting with your reconnecting with a higher power. Uh, because at some point, I do feel like perhaps when you're dealing with the situation, you kind of lost touch of that. So I feel like you're finding a you're finding uh, alignment here, or that you're becoming more aligned here by reconnecting here. The chariot, the high priestess, Cancer, Pisces here, the magician, and the three of pentacles here. So what's happening is I feel like you're trusting your intuition here. You're trusting your higher self here. Like I said, I feel like you're realigning with yourself. You're reconnecting with yourself here. You're raising from the darkness here. And I feel like you're you're definitely manifesting what you want. And I feel like you're surrounding yourself with people that's supporting, uh, that's supportive of this journey here uh, 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 that you're going through. Yeah, so you're definitely going through like a spiritual transformation here or that you're, you're, you're blossoming here. Like I said, I feel like it's almost like rising from the ashes, rising out of the darkness here, okay? So I feel like you're putting like a period at the end of the story here regarding someone here that's coming back into your life or an old life that you're just leaving behind, okay? So Pisces, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. I'll speak to you guys in the next one. All right. Thanks, guys. Bye.